morning, Chef Creole. Want to let you guys know, gentrification is happening. It's happening in Overtown. It's happening in Liberty City. It's happening in Little Haiti. Gentrification is happening pretty much all over the place. And what they want to do, they want to define it as a change for the better. But it's a change for the better for who? For the people that's coming, that's creating this gentrification, or for the people that's been there already, existing? That's the big question you have to ask. And if it's for the change for the better, shouldn't the people that have been existing there prior to these so-called changes be included in the future of the direction that the community is happened to be going? We're talking about changes for the better. But little by little, you start to see the people that been existing there, little by little is being excluded. And five years come around the corner, you start to see those people even much more minimized to the point where they're gonna be non-existent. This ain't the first time that they've been exercising gentrification. This is a old, uh, how can I call it? This is an old slick method of coming in there and having this, giving people this impression that I'm out to make your community better, but at the end of the day, my community now is better without me. The District 3 races are upon us. And you better find out who's going to be the best one to lead us to be included in these gentrifications that's going on in our community. And I'm going to tell you who's my candidate and who's my candidate and I'm never going to impose my candidate to be your candidate, but I'm going to give you the solid truth so that way you can make your decision. But at the end of the day, it's very clear. Vote. Vote. Be educated. Take your position. Whether you're a Democrat or whether you're a Republican. But know that what's important when it comes to voting is going to be local government. You're talking about commissioners. You're talking about mayors. You're talking about state representation. If it's local, you better be involved. Because it's going to affect you directly. And like I said before, the big order that's on the list is gentrification. If you're not here to benefit from those changes, then that means you've been excluded from the table.